The metaverse is not a specific place or one type of technology we are refers to. It refers to a shift in those how we interact with the technologies, how to interact in a virtual environment and especially in a virtual and augmented reality that taking about the metaverse that has compared to the internet or cyberspace in the way back in 1970. That is the advanced concept or modern approach of the cyberspace in way back in 1970 and now it's the form of a new digital environment, a virtual environment and virtual platform that consists of a network of 3D virtual world that focused on social connections. The science fictions and are often described as a hypothetical iteration of those internet as a single universal virtual world and those universal virtual platform that is facilitated by the use of those virtual and augmented reality. There is already a metaverse in the gaming platform, in the digital entertainment, the online and virtual entertainment and it's an important and some social element of this metaverse that can already be found. The people will gradually shifting or migrating to the metaverse in the future. They leaving those reality behind of the world and that can we create and manage. There will come to a moment when the virtual world are so absorbing, so accepting to the people entirely that is technology friendly and that can handle that will not be one to leave and metaverse will come at a important and new way a modern age technology and those platform that is expert form as it look like a 3d model of internet basically a place that is parallel to the physical world where you can spend your digital life a place where you you and other people have an avatar, a new form, a new model of an entity or character or virtual environment entity. It's as a term as an avatar and that you can interact with them in various avatar and various fields and that is work towards a dream project of a metaverse by those large companies and many important companies, IT companies, they are investing in the metaverse. They are keep training those employees in the metaverse platform that they can build their entire ecosystem, the virtual environment and the virtual ecosystem in this particular virtual environment. The next 10 to 15 years and they can train people to build those a strong and supportive metaverse platform and that's those new building technologies, product and services of the metaverse that is on central focus and that can form a team that will work on this metaverse platform. The vulnerability and the security that may be a loopholes that are likely to play in this metaverse platform that is a 3D environment, virtual and the immersive technology that are working to, together that is a long term and that's navigate the online world similar to the way the metaverse is in the real world, but the digital field that the concept of metaverse that become a reality. Lines between a digital and the physical spaces that will become an even more important. And because of those infrastructure, the metaverse is expected to bring a totally new form of cyber crimes, phishing, malware, hacking, all those important possibilities that can thanks to the metaverse personal nature and the data that they are generated and they can handle those incident, those cyber incident and that the virtual headset, digital avatar that provide those more intimate looks. Many experts have the opinion, they, have, they warn about the disruption in the digital platform, the digital integration and the adoptions in a security platform for a digital environment that owing to innovation in the metaverse that could have far reaching the consequences due to the 
multi-sensory nature of the environment. As it stands currently, the new technologies like virtual reality, augmented reality, all came with the security as an afterthought and not built by the design. It needs to change. That is the opinion that it's not built by design. It is, needs to be changed. For the metaverse, the security challenges are heightened due to the level of valuable personal data that user might potentially share digitally. This can include the biometrics and the personal and financial data to create a digital self within the metaverse. At the same time, the data will be shared in the real time, making it difficult to determine exactly what personal data is actually shared with whom for what purpose and then when it is destroyed. That makes it difficult for the user to exercise the control over the data. There are new arena in which the startups and entrepreneurs can seize an advantage over the big technological companies uh, in that particular field that is a metaverse. According to the uh, important report, I mean, a trusted report that is the metaverse is a 3D immersive and collaborative experiences that are already making their way into the life. They can impact in our daily life. They can be created those buzzword and dependency in our daily lifestyle. The virtual environment, the virtual platform that is working towards how it interact with those metaverse platform. And many entrepreneurs, startup founders, they thought that it will change the world in the next few years and that is how they impact it. The future metaverse can also be a huge contributing factor for the growth of the virtual economy which depends on video games and a virtual world where disruptions are almost nil and such cases that the increasing number of a metaverse NFT and those enthusiast people that also sensing those opportunity to invest on virtual land on such games and sell or rent them for a price people with no actual interest in the metaverse who look them at financial yielding domain could invest in equity of the firms working on the concept. Many people thought that they describe as metaverse Metaverse as a three-dimensional internet that is populated with live people. The universal scene description that is a specification for the 3D computer graphics interchange. And they use those technological companies and that would adopt the Metaverse development tool to create those open standards for access to virtual and augmented reality devices and the experiences and metaverse is stalled from achieving the scale by a lack of infrastructure by both hardware and software and those approach to the platform development the lack of clear governance standard the information privacy that is an area of concern for the metaverse because of related companies will likely collect those user data, personal information through the interactions and the biometric data from wearable virtual and augmented reality devices. In the coming days, the metaverse will change the world. It will change the digital environment, the digital and virtual platform that we experience in the future. And many companies will realize that they have spent time, money and employee training to get those environment and ecosystem in the metaverse platform that will work in the next 10 to 15 years and that will be a dream for the 3D virtual spaces that will be achieved in the coming years. That's all for now. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.